Hey everybody, how's it going? Uh, today, uh, this is not this is not going to be uh, any kind of video console repair. I'm just going to talk about my microscope that I'm using here. This is an NMScope SE400Z. Um, I decided to buy this one because uh, I saw some benefits using this M-scope. Uh, I saw the opinion from Louis Rossman, which I'm going to give you the, the link below in the description. Uh, about the, the benefits of it, but there were some also some cons uh, about the, the amp scope and for me For me one of the cons was regarding about the light normally you have to use this uh, light is attached to the microscope and When you're working with with the microscope you cannot you have to adjust the light to allow you to see better uh, uh, to allow to see much better the, the motherboard sometimes when you have to zoom in, then you have to adjust this it, it's, uh, for me it's like a, um, it gives a, li a little bit of uh, work uh, it doesn't allow me to um, work very fast sometimes I need to put the light much closer or not so uh, I have been doing a research because this M scope it doesn't allow you to put this kind of lens like I have here into the microscope so uh, after doing some research on the internet I have found a, a link which uh, explained to you how to adapt this light uh, this light slides into the end scope uh, I'm also going to give you the, the, the description below from the, the person who who will allow me to create this uh, this new adjustment so um, there is uh, it was explain me explain on, on the on web page that with this this is the uh, adapter for the to put here on my microscope it allows you and, and it was printed 3d as well so there you can see also the pictures in, in the 3d format so you can send this to um to a company to do the, the 3d printer and to allow you to to allow you to attach here on the microscope so this one and also th this one is very simple as you can see and below you have the the possibilities to um, put the lens around the this 3d adapter for the m scope this is also have the the name of the of the model of the make uh, of the of the microscope um, for me, this is a, a, a basic and simple solution for for me to allow to work with the lights. So this one is the this is one that came from the uh, originally from the, the microscope. So basically, what I'm do is I'm just going to put this back again. I've decided to remove it from from the microscope. Let me just adjust this. Put here the screw. Just closing it. Okay. And now with this, with the light, um, with the LED, uh, LED light, I will just need to. Adjust how should I set this like this? And that's it, it's quite easy. And for me, it's much more simple to adjust zooming without having any problem if I've been using this. Otherwise, sometimes I need to put the light much closer to see it. Or sometimes I have to put more away. So for me, this is a, a best solution for to working with the um, with this uh, 3D adapter. I don't know uh, M scope SE 400Z. Uh, this was the best uh, the best thing I have found out on the internet. 
which allowed me to use this kind of uh, LED light. Um, I will. I have tried. I, ha I have been working with this, uh, just playing around, so how to see how it, how it goes. So for me, it's much easier for me to control it, and also I can adjust the light like this, in in the when when I need it. So um, this is just a small video to show for the people who are working with this uh, kind of the end scope. Uh, it's quite simple. I have played this around just to do the 3D print around four between two four no sorry between two eight to ten dollars uh, here it's around six to seven euros. Um, it took about 24 hours to be delivered, so it was really really fast in, in Portugal. Um, so that's it. Uh, I will try to do any any more uh, any more videos doing some repairs. I hope you guys are trying to see this uh, solution for the this kind of um, model of the M scope. Um, then I will see you in the next couple of videos. Hit the button if you like it. Help me to subscribe uh, more people to to join my channel. Uh, I hope to certainly reach around the 100 views to give me the URL um, link for the YouTube channel. See you soon. Bye.